It was in the late 1930s when the substances, popularly known as anabolic steroids were first developed for the treatment of hypogonadism, which is incompetence of the gonads, especially due to low production of testosterone in males. Hypogonadism is the condition in which male testes do not produce sufficient testosterone for normal growth, development, and sexual functioning. It results in deficient development of secondary sex characteristics and in prepubertal males, a body with long legs and a short trunk. Anabolic steroids were primarily produced for medical use. They were initially used to treat delayed puberty, and some types of impotence. Later, many scientists conducting studies on anabolic steroids found that these steroids could facilitate the growth of skeletal muscles in laboratory animals. The studies led to the use of anabolic steroids in the treatment of wasting of the body due to HIV infection or various other diseases. However, the growth-triggering property of anabolic steroids also led to abuse of anabolic steroids by bodybuilders, weightlifters, athletes, and jocks in other sports. Anabolic steroids are one of the most popular as well as one of the most controversial drugs today. They are available in various brands on the market. Anabolic steroids are available as oral anabolic steroids, injectable anabolic steroids, and anabolic steroid gels or creams. These drugs are usually taken in the pattern called cycling, which means taking doses of anabolic steroids over a specific period of time, stopping for a period, and starting again. Anabolic steroids are used in stacks, and this way of using steroids is called stacking, which means using anabolic steroids combining different types of steroids. Often anabolic steroids are used in stacks by bodybuilders or other power jocks. The users believe that stacking anabolic steroids help to produce an effect on muscle size that is greater than the effects of using each drug individually. Another popular way of using anabolic steroids is pyramiding, which is the process in which steroid users step up the use of steroids slowly. They increase the number of drugs used at one time and slash or the dose and frequency of one or more steroids, reaching the highest amount at mid-cycle and slowly narrowing the dose toward the end of the cycle.